Hello print family, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing some more ink mixing. Uh, as you see on the screen here, this is a t-shirt that this is the actual t-shirt I printed uh, with the colors. So it's a baby reveal, so the colors we're needing of course are going to be blue and pink. And I'm sure you can hear the thunder in the background. Uh, we've been getting a lot of, a lot of rain and, and thunderstorms here in Houston this last week. But anyways, without a further ado, let's go ahead and get these inks a mixing. All right, guys, so the first ink that we're going to be mixing is going to be the pink. 708C is the Pantone color, pink. All right, so with this, I'm going to be doing 350 grams uh, for the total mixing. Uh, the white, the mixing white, we're going to need 311.60. Anytime you add a color when you're doing the mixing, you always want to make sure you hit the tear button. What the tear button does is it zeroes out your scale. So for instance, if you're going to add whatever color, if it's white or whatever color you're using, after you add the weight that you're looking for, always hit the tear button to zero. Because if you start adding the additional ink, the different color ink in, and it's not been teared out, you're going to mess up the, the formula and you'll have to start over and waste whatever ink you have in there. So always make sure you hit the tear function. Majestic Magenta will be 19.92.
Blazed orange will be 9.0 grams. Electric red is 8.58 grams. Okay, so for the blue, so we're gonna do another 350 grams of the blue. The blue color we're using is gonna be Pantone color 2192C, that's 2192C. The mixing white, we're gonna need 262.50 grams.
The indigo blue, we're going to need 78.75 grams. Aquamarine, we're going to need 8.75 grams. Now these are the, the I used the Epic Rio mixing system, so all these are going to be the Epic Rio mixing system uh, inks that I'm using on this. Uh, through my computer to uh, plug in the Pantone number colors off of the color chips that uh, the color chips that you uh, that you use, you know, for max mixing your colors. Uh, if you guys need one of those, I have a link down in my description where you can pick up one of those. It's very important you have those. If you have a client that's wanting to uh, have a special color mix, you have got to have uh, these Pantone colors, the correct ones, and be able to mix to achieve the right Pantone color that they're requesting. Every month I'm getting orders that come in, uh, especially from like schools and stuff, saying, hey, I need this shirt done, I need this color. And they, Most of the teachers, if they've done this for a while, will go ahead and tell me the Pantone colors and stuff that they need. Uh, some of the newer some of the newer people in the school you know you may get some of the teachers that don't know uh, when you're doing that you have to work with them a little bit. Uh, the best thing I re recommend is going to uh, schedule a meeting, go meet up with the teacher and take your color flip charts with you, your, your Pantone color uh, mixing chips with you that way you can find the exact color, they, that way they can see the colors and choose the colors from there and then you get the Pantone straight from that. Uh, but it's really important if your clients request a Pantone color uh, that you give them the Pantone color that they're requesting. You know, when you're mixing something for school, it's one thing, but also when you're, it's important. But it's even more important if you're doing in the corporate world. I've got a Burger King account, and when they request their special Pantone colors for their logos, that is what you've got to reproduce. So keep that in mind. All right, guys, thank you so much for checking out this video. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the section below. If you guys want to support this channel, I have affiliate links down in the description below. It'll take you to everything you've seen in the video, and I have other links in there as well. Um, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching this video, and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care.